Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. My name is Jean, you guys watching Tech Talk. Since the Mavic 2 Pro and the Mavic 2 Zoom came out over two years ago, DJI had released drones after drones. So we had the Mavic Air 2, the Mavic Air 2S, the Mavic Mini, the Mavic Mini 2, the Mavic Mini SC, and lastly on all this, the DJI FPV. So Mavic Pro fan just kept waiting and hoping the next DJI release will be the Mavic 3 Pro. So the wait is finally over guys. The Mavic 3 Pro is coming this week and this time it's for real. So November 5th, that's when DJI is gonna announce the Mavic 3 Pro. So I'm gonna share my personal opinion with you and what should you expect this week from DJI? So let's get to it. Welcome back to the channel guys and thanks for watching this video and thanks for subscribing to the channel if you already subscribed. My name is Jean and you are watching Tech Talk. Tech Talk is a channel where I share my personal opinion with you guys on a weekly basis on the latest tech. So the latest tech for this week is the new DJI Mavic 3 Pro. So it is a big week for all Mavic Pro fans. Um, most of us been waiting for this news for over two years and it is coming this week. I'm talking about the Mavic 3 Pro announcement this Friday guys. So DJI has been extremely busy lately releasing new product and new upgrades since the last few weeks. But the most important product that DJI is going to release this year for us is coming soon. It's coming November 5th. So the Mavic 3 Pro will be announced this week. But what should we expect from DJI? So if we remember the Mavic 2 announcement over three years ago, DJI actually released two new drones, not just one, two. Uh, we had the Mavic 2 Pro, uh, then we have the Mavic 2 Zoom, which was a little bit, di uh, slightly uh, different than the Mavic 2 Pro. So for this announcement, we can expect a similar announcement. Uh, we can expect two new drones as well. So if the rumors are right, DJI will release the regular Mavic 3 Pro and the Mavic 3 Pro Cine. So the Mavic 3 Pro will be a major improvement over the Mavic 2 Pro. The Mavic 2 Pro came out with a one-inch sensor, uh, with a more professional camera. Uh, we had a bump in flight time, 31 minutes, mark flex time for the battery, which was a big improvement. Uh, we had AccuSync 2.0 and a lot more goodies. Uh, but with the Mavic 3 Pro, we know things gonna get even better, guys, okay? I believe we will see a half inch sensor or better, okay? We'll have a more advanced camera. Uh, we can expect a big bump in flight time up to 46 minutes. Uh, we're definitely gonna see IQSync 3.0, which will help with, for better connection. Uh, we can expect to see a new flight controller, uh, or maybe the same controller that DJI been using in uh, the Mavic Air and the Mavic Air 2S. So the Mavic 3 Pro Cine, just like the Mavic 2 Zoom, if we remember, Mavic 2 Zoom was one of the first drone from DJI that actually allowed us to zoom during flight for close-up and better shot. The Mavic 3 Pro Cine drone will have a better zooming capability. Okay, I think the drone will have two cameras on board. We have uh, one wide angle and one with a telephoto lens and definitely longer battery life. We can also expect a more professional controller for the Mavic 3 Pro Cine. But also we can expect a big jump in price for both drones. So what is my final opinion today guys? The Mavic 3 Pro and the Mavic 3 Pro Cine will be the best drone to get this year. 
So DJI waited for a long time to release the Mavic 3 Pro for a lot of good reasons. We can expect these two drones to get a lot more expensive also when you compare them to uh, the Mavic 2 Pro, okay? So there you have it guys, that's all I have for today's video. Thank you for watching. If you enjoy topics like this, consider subscribing to the channel. Take care of yourself guys and see you guys next time for my next video guys. Thanks for watching. See you guys next time.